My understanding is that you went to the southern border. Now, you're saying that you're going to give people facts. What did you take away from that experience, and what kind of reporting are you going to be bringing back from that experience? I'll tell you a fact I took away. I talked to the head of all the border guards down there, the, the head of the union. I asked him straight up, kids are coming over the border with numbers written on them, phone numbers and addresses. Mm -hmm. Do we check those out? He said, well, we call them. Is it possible that we're sending them into known prostitution rings or sweatshops? He said, it's not possible, it is absolute. We are using American tax dollars to ship children into known prostitution All and sweatshops. Or some children? Well, who knows? Okay. We don't know. I said, are you... So what kind of checking do they do? So They, they call the say, number uh -huh, and, and say, do you know about this child? They say, yes. Will you receive them when they come? Yes. I said, is it possible that that's a prostitution ring? He said, we, ha we know enough to know that it, in a number of cases, it has turned out to be absolute sex ring. It has turned out to be an absolute sweatshop. I said, how is this possible? Well, what do they and he do said, then? it is happening. What do they do then if they know that that's happening? Where is the U.S. Attorney's Office? Where is the... Here's the Damn here's good the question. You have, to, you have to re-ask that question when we come okay. back. Because okay. we're coming back with more with Dr. Phil.